Hey everybody, it's Father Bryce. Welcome to our Wednesday evening Ask and Answer. Uh, this question is a, a simple one. It's, uh, do you need a college degree to become a priest? Um, and um, the answer is that almost always, like 98% of the time or something, um, if you don't have a college degree before becoming a priest, you get a college degree uh, becoming a priest. So, um, yeah, so for example, um, I went to, um, I started college and then I went to the seminary to prepare to become a priest. And at the seminary, I got uh, a bachelor's degree in philosophy and the liberal arts. And then after that, um, now, now that I had the foundation, I, I needed to study theology. And so after I got the bachelor's degree in philosophy and liberal arts, I went off to um, a different seminary and I got a master's degree in theological studies. Um, so I've got a, a bachelor's degree and a master's degree. And um, most priests, almost every priest, like 98% of the priests who you talk to um, have something like that. Um, they have a bachelor's degree in something. They have some training in philosophy. And then uh, they have some kind of a master's degree, either a master's in divinity or, um, or a master's of arts in theology. And simple as that. Um, and the reason is, well, so that we can be so that we can be well trained um, to teach about the faith, uh, so that we can be well trained to to be experts, please Jesus in the moral life, so that when you come to confession, we can give you good penances and 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 good things to do, uh, not just have your sins forgiven in the moment, which confession will do, no matter if the penance is good or bad, or if the advice is good or bad, but also like help you to overcome the temptations to those sins in the future and to grow in virtue. Um, we have to study the Bible and study the Bible and study the Bible so that we can preach from the Word of God, uh, especially on Sundays. As you come to Mass, we read from the Bible, and then what are we supposed to do? We're supposed to break open the Bible like in ways you can understand it so that we we, we had better know the Bible um, very well um, and know how things work. Like, how does baptism work? Baptism is important. you got to be baptized to go to heaven. Uh, so that's like really, really important. We know like how baptism works. What does confirmation do? Um, why do we give anointing of the sick? And, and how does that help people like in their walk with Jesus? Um, what do we mean when we say the creed? Like every Sunday, we all say, I believe in one God, the Father Almighty, creator of heaven and earth, and on and on and on. What do we mean when we say that? And it's our job like to teach you that. And it's our job to continue to enter into that mystery ourselves as we live as disciples and to help you enter into those mysteries um, as, as you also live as disciples as we walk together on this road of discipleship. Um, so, you don't have to have a college degree to start the process of discernment and formation to become a priest, um, but you do have a college degree after you're finished, um, a bachelor's degree in something, uh, usually something to do with philosophy, some training in philosophy for sure, and a master's degree in divinity, they call it, or uh, a master of arts in theology, um, like Father Patrick and I have. So that's it. Um, Y'all have a great, uh, a great evening, and we'll see y'all for Mass this weekend. Um, either in person or if you're ill or infirm or unable to come uh, on online. God bless you.